upon your full cooperation with the military authorities. Johnny, the world is on fire with excitement. Why? Joe Biden has agreed to debate Trump. Yeah, he's agreed. Oh, yeah, I don't know about whether he... But Johnny, aren't you excited? The whole world is excited. Yeah, well, I don't know whether it's all that exciting, Johnny. Johnny, ain't here in Australia, it's... I mean, isn't that what bloody politicians are supposed to do, especially the upcoming leaders? Aren't they supposed to have a bloody debate? What's the big fucking... And welcome to Hannity. Wow, what a news night. Panic is in the air. That's what you used to bloody see. Oh, the old days, yeah, the good old days. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a debate. Suddenly, out of the blue, Joe Biden says he's ready to take on Trump. Now all these leaders just say, no, we're not debating. We don't want to debate. And that seems to be the end of it. Here's how the news covered it. <laughs> Former President Donald Trump agreed to two debates ahead of the election in November. The first one to be held on CNN, held at their studios in Atlanta on June 27th. The president wants to debate. He's a very competitive, uh, you know, locker room, like old school athlete, <laughs> old school athlete who wants to uh, debate his rival. Come on, Jeff, you're smarter than that. And literally no one on God's green earth thinks of Joe Biden as an athlete in his prime. But what got me about this bloody announcement from Joe was the way he delivered it. Now you bloody mention it. Yeah, the way he delivered it, Johnny, it was like he, would, he was channeling Clint Eastwood. Man's got to know his limitations. Have a listen to him. All right, let's go with it. Donald Trump lost two debates to me in 2020. Since then, he hadn't shown up for debate. Now he's acting like he wants to debate me again. Well, make my day, pal. I'll even do it twice. So let's pick the dates, Donald. I hear you're free on Wednesdays. Wow, I just made my day. <laughs> now, if that doesn't strike fear into the heart of the Trumpster, I don't know what would. Well, do you, punk? Well, make my day, pal. I'll even do it twice. But Jesus, I haven't seen Joe so bloody, uh, aggressively bloody, uh, galvanised uh, ever. Well, oh, yeah, I suppose it is a bit strange. Yeah, he's had something injected into him, Johnny. He's had some sort of bloody, uh, I don't know, stuff put in him to make him fire up, perhaps a coffee enema. <laughs> yeah, I reckon. But, Johnny, think about the excitement. The excitement of having these two 80-year-old blokes going at it, toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Let's remember when Joe Biden, uh, when he actually just... Doesn't know when to read the teleprompter or not. Remember this? Imagine what we can do next. Four, Four more years. Pause. Four more years. <laughs> oh, <laughs> pause. He read pause off the teleprompter. What we can do next. Four, Four more years. Pause. Four more years. <laughs> Four more years. And then, he's, and then he smiles like he's all proud of himself. Well, I think Joe may be channeling Clint now you bloody mention it. I've never seen him come out and make such bold, bare-ass fucking statements before. But Johnny, the astute viewers, and we got a lot of astute viewers watching the Ask Johnny channel. The <laughs> astute viewers may have noticed there are a lot of cuts. In Joe's bloody blistering fucking challenge. Donald Trump lost two debates to me in 2020. Since then, he hadn't shown up for debate. Now he's acting like he wants to debate me again. Well, make my day, pal. I'll even do it twice. So let's pick the dates, Donald. I hear you're free on Wednesdays. Now, that even means that uh, some arty farty directors trying to make him look better than he is. Or could he be a robot? Or, more realistically... Poor old Joe could only get one sentence out of it. Poor old Joe could only get one sentence out of it. Poor old Joe could only get one sentence out at a time before he fucked it up and they had to keep going and recutting it. So, yeah, it's my mind. Yeah, yeah. I mean, if they had any more cuts, Johnny, they could, it'd turn into like that stop action bloody stuff they used to do in the horror films and the, and the monster films and that years ago. Do you think Clint's been advising Joe there? They're nearly the same age. 
But rest assured, Johnny, it's going to be one hell of a night. Well, make my day, pal. I'll even do it twice.